Hey, what's going on guys? It's Kenny here and welcome back to another best class setup and this is going to be the SMGs. My favorite SMG starting off, um, I always use the Vector from the beginning and it seems to be like my favorite. I mean, I've tried the MTAR, it's pretty good too. Um, if I had to choose though, I'd definitely choose the Vector over the MTAR, but the MTAR would be my second favorite if you guys were wondering. Um, this, all these other guns, I mean, they're okay, but I just feel like these two do the most damage and feel the best for me. So, uh, what I use on it is Oslo, or, um, this is kind of your option if you want to like hide more, if you feel like people are finding you or you can't seem to stay alive because they know where you're at at all times, you might want to put on silencer. But for me, I love muzzle break on this gun. It gives it that little bit of extra damage that kind of makes up for it's not so high as the like the other guns have a really high fire rate for the most part. If you look at them here, um, the Bison really high, CBJ, the K7, the Vector. And the only one that really doesn't is the MTAR. So I guess that my two favorites are the ones with the lower fire rate, or the fire rate, sorry. Um, yeah, so the Vector is definitely my favorite SMG. I put that muzzle brake on, it gives it that little damage to make up for the slow fire rate. Or, if you want, you can also put on rapid fire to make up for that. So, anyway, I use that. I use foregrip, which I already said in my AK video is probably the best attachment in this game. Literally, no recoil. That's what it feels like. It's like a no recoil hack. <laughs> and, yeah, so no secondary like usual. If you guys are running um, assault kill streaks or something, and you don't really think you need all these perks, and if you're just, or if you're running support, I, I should say assault, you probably want perks because you're going for the high kill streaks. But if you're running support, and you're like, you know what, I die, I understand, I'm gonna keep dying, but I still like my kill streaks, then you might want to throw on a secondary, mm -hmm. or maybe a tactical, depending on what game type you're playing, domination, a uh, tactical would probably be pretty good, especially on small maps. But um, for me, I, I just, you know what, I'm like, you know what, running gun, that's all I am. So I take all these off, put it in the perks, like I said, it's the same perks as my AK class. I got ready upside of hand for my number two, Stalker, Quick Draw, and Hardline, which helps with my strike package, obviously, because, and it helps if you guys are going for those chem strikes. Every two assists counts this as a kill. So you could have, like, 18 kills and 400 assists, or I don't know how many it is, but, and you get your chem strikes. So there you guys go. If you want that, if you're going for chems, definitely throw on that Hardline. It helps out a bunch. And as before, the only thing I changed up in my specialist package is uh, ICU instead of um, Amplify. That's what it was. I was trying to think. Because uh, somebody mentioned it in my comments that uh, I should put on ICU instead of Amplify. And it was actually pretty good because recently my sound, I usually play with it pretty low because I'm streaming or something. And I don't really use Amplify as much as I could. But, I mean, if I'm going to go try hard or something, if I really need to, like, pump out a nice gameplay or something, I'd definitely throw on Amplify over ICU. But... For, for what I do, and for having the low game volume, and I seem to get shot a lot with the SMG because, you know, you can't do very much damage from a far distance. If they have an assault rifle, you're pretty much like, oh, God, I'm going to get tagged. So ICU is good for that. It's good at trying to stay alive and, uh, you know, just hide and stuff and recover that health. But anyway, uh, first one, Scavenger, because I don't have on extent, or the fully loaded perk. So Scavenger is always a must. Deadeye is really, really good on everything. Like I said, off the grid. This one I could probably change out because I'm not even using a silencer, so they're still going to see me if I shoot. So I could probably change that one out, but I'm just going to keep it on there. You know, it helps with the staying off the SAT comms and stuff. Every little bit helps. Um, ICU, like I said, would be my bonus one. People are, are spamming my Twitter left and right. Holy crap. Okay. Um, we got uh, Focus, which is really good, obviously. You know, it's like Toughness and Black Ops 2, the best perk ever. Uh, attack resist and blast shield resist which are really really good things um, that I like and that would be my best class setup So I will see you guys I'm gonna put on some gameplay probably with the music like I did in the assault one Let me know if you guys like that if not then I'll just do this and that'll be the end of the video So if you guys want to see the gameplay and you like the music just let me know for the other classes that I'm gonna do and I'll see you guys in the video I'm